tell me what you enjoy most about the show. This is like the one of the rawest shows I've seen in, in a long time. And it's like L.A. culture, you know what I'm saying? So this is something that we can really identify with. And it's dope because you get to see, like, you know, they, there's rumors about the involvement of the FBI and, the, you know, the police and, as far as within the, the drug you know, uh, you know, coming out with in LA. So to see that dynamics, the fact that they let them get away with with putting that on TV, you know, what I'm saying it's crazy. It's real dope. Now your last gig was huge. What new projects are you working on? Um, I have a, a project called Cutthroat City that'll be coming out soon. Um, I don't know the date yet, but I'm happy. I'm going to uh, I'm going to Comic Con this weekend to go do a panel. Yeah, with uh, with RZA and Ti. Ti be there. I think Terrence Howard will be there. They're all in the movie and stuff. RZA directed it, so. I'm really excited about that. It's like an ensemble cast. It's a great, great piece with a lot of dope people in it. So I'm happy about that. I'm so excited for you, and I'm happy about all of your success. Do you ever feel like you're in this box because you look so much like Tupac and you did the movie? Do you feel like it's hard for you to get roles now? Nah, I don't believe that. <laughs> I, I, it's, it's a resemblance there if you, like, start really paying attention. But, you know, once I grow my hair, I'll do a little something different, wear a little. You know what I'm saying? It's, I'm myself. Well, maybe you'll be in season two or season three of Snowfall. I have a feeling you might be. This will be a dope one. I, I don't know. <laughs>